Meantime, the search effort continues tonight to find the group of men responsible for violent and coordinated attacks on Detroit's west side. Our Priya Mann is live at Detroit Police Headquarters tonight. And Priya, police say this group has already raped two women. That's right, Sandra. Detroit police believe the two attacks on Thursday are connected. They don't know if they're gang related, and now they're investigating another brutal gang rape and robbery that happened earlier this month. Tonight, this West Side neighborhood has had enough. Back in the day, when you stole, they cut your hands off. When you raped, you lost body parts. So, unfortunately, in this society, it seems like that's what we need to get back to in order for some of this to cut down. Outrage is building after a series of brutal gang rapes and robberies on the west side. In the most recent attacks, young women were gang raped in front of the men they were with. Very mad because they're with their man or a husband or whoever it is and they still can't be protected. On Thursday at McNichols and Burwood, a woman was raped by six men. The couple was forced to undress and then robbed. I seen the girl first, and she was running, and she had on a little black tank top and nothing on under. And I'm like, look to the left, like, whoa, like, whatever, you know what I'm saying? And I seen him about four feet behind her, and he running, he just got boxers on. Half a mile away at McNichols and Sorrento, a woman was raped in front of a man she was with. That attack carried out by four men shortly before midnight on Thursday. A man who says he saw the first couple says initially he thought it was a domestic dispute. Her face was just like frantic. She was like terrified and like, well, she was full speed like this. And then when she got to the door, she looked back, I guess, to see if her boyfriend or fiance or whatever he is was coming. And he was like right behind her, and they ran right into the store. And but his his face was the same as hers. He running like this, like. Take a look at these police sketches. Investigators believe this man was involved in both attacks on Thursday. And now Detroit police investigating a third gang rape and robbery that happened on July 11th near Pearson and West McNichols. A couple was robbed. The woman was raped. Police believe two men were involved. Right now, they don't have very much information, so they're asking anyone who may know anything to give them a call or to call Crime Stoppers. Reporting live from DPD headquarters, I'm Priya Matt, Local 4. Yeah, police need those tips desperately. All right, thank you, Priya. And today, members of Detroit 300 were out in neighborhoods. They were passing out sketches of those men. Once again, if you have any information at all, call Detroit Police or Crime Stoppers. That number is 1-800-SPEAK-UP.